Hello everyone, welcome to eSupport for Research. In this particular video, I will try to demonstrate how you can able to perform free general search in Scoopers platform. You can also do you know search related to book series and proceeding that is index in Scoopers uh, you know database. And it is again uh, you have a free access to do that. So let's do that and we'll try to understand in between you know all the different matrices and free uh, you know general search of what uh, and how you can able to perform. So if you visit you know Scoopers home page and this I will keep it in the description section so it will be easy for you to locate. So you have this two you know one you have is to find out free author profile about that I have already prepared a video and how you can able to you know find out your Scoopers profile or your let's say your colleague uh, scoopers profile uh, the search how you can able to perform that already i have prepared a video on that that also i'll keep it in the description section but here today we'll try to understand how you can able to find out the sources that are indexed in scoopers platform so the second one as you can see over here is uh, looking for you know free general uh, ranking and matrices so you can click over here view general ranking or else you can go to this sources both way it will uh, lead you to this page where you can perform a search to find out journal book series or let's say what else you can find out all this thing you can see conference proceeding trade publication and journal and book series so uh, what we'll do we'll select here you know you can see it might show you initially title uh, you can select the subject area because you know uh, you do not know which uh, title you are looking for or general title and you you want to perform a broad search based on your subject area so this is where you know uh, those who are writing a manuscript or in the process of you know finalizing a manuscript and thinking to submit your work to a scoopers index uh, platform to a journal or book series or you know proceeding then you can perform this subject uh, uh, you can select the subject area and perform a search so what we'll do we'll select the subject area but you do not need to write here you have to select here like uh, let's say your subject area falls under computer science so what you have to select here is you have to go down okay computer science and uh, the manuscript that you have written is somewhere you know related with artificial intelligence and let's say there is uh, computer network communication and let's say human computer interaction is there and uh, also signal processing so this four keyword i have selected from computer science and now you have to uh, you know click on apply so you see uh, this subject area this has this four, four you know keyword has been selected area has been selected and it is showing 899 result that means it comprises of journal book series conference proceeding and trade publication so now let's say you want to only see uh, the journal publication and you do not want to you know submit to your work to book series or conference proceeding but uh, that 899 you can have a glance over here you can you know select the different pages to see and this is being sorted based on the source uh, site uh, you know title then the site score uh, highest site score then the highest percentile that is received then the citation and document uh, document from the year 2018 to 21 uh, so you can alter this one also if you click on that so it will be uh, placed in the reverse order you can see that you know in alphabetically it is now in reverse order and even if the site score also so that is up to you to you know uh, do that and uh, what i can do is uh, as i am looking for only journal so you can uh, select over here moreover let's say you want to you know, submit your work to only q1 and q2 quartile journal so here this two also you can submit so what i what are this quartile we'll uh, discuss more on that in the future video and uh, what more uh, about citation i'm not select, uh, selecting anything so just i'm uh, applying my filter with uh, the source type and quartile q1 and q2 and i will click on apply so now when you do that you see from 899 to it became i you know 443 result that means only journals has been selected and now you have all the journal 
so based on this uh, you know this keyword or subject area it is now showing and now uh, let's see once you got the result you uh, felt that you know uh, somewhere this uh, computer network and communication is not relevant so you want to exclude so no need to do uh, you know again a sort of a new search here you can cross this one if you cross that one it will be removed and you see the result has been decreased to 295 so now you have this many you know journals and you want to do more refined search so that also you have other sort of you know way of doing that so you can do that and um, let's say we'll select one journal to just to see uh, what else it is you know providing us so if you click on this journal let's say this you want to verify so what you need to verify is the scopus coverage year it has to be uh, from whatever year to present if it is written to present that means it is still you know in the scopus uh, sort of indexing and it is continuing so you are at safer side to you know proceed with some mission so that's where many of the time you know we do receive query uh, this uh, has been from this year to that year and now from this to that year but better to be at safer side you must cross check that thing here and if you found uh, uh, and you have certain you know requirement from your university to submit to a journal with SGR value of certain and SNFA value of certain you know uh, sort of range so you can verify this thing also what is site score SGR and SNFP we'll discuss in a uh, later video in a future video uh, so this is where you know you can able to find out journal and now uh, it is up to you to decide uh, among this 295 journal where to submit moreover you want to download all this journal whatever you have done whatever way you have refined it and you want to send to your student that these are the journal that you can think for or list you want to share so you have to select here select all and export to excel once you do that you have to have a account over here at scopus then only you can able to download i have already you know uh, made a video on that also how to create a profile at scopus and then you can able to perform different uh, sort of you know uh, thing or to download you know sort of data like this so and uh, to save data also like your publication record or other sort of thing so this is uh, uh, required uh, you should have a account over there so that you can perform this sort of thing and many of the time we do receive query like uh, i do not have till now any in sort of publication that's why i do not have scoopers id but without having scoopers id also can have a scoopers account over here so that you can have at least uh, do this sort of you know uh, thing so that you can uh, you can share the data among you with your student and later on once you have your publication then you can link uh, those things with your you know id so that um, uh, it will be automatically you know updated and there is uh, no need to worry on that so this is how you can do that you if you sign into this page because i have till now whatever i have demonstrated i have not yet signed in and uh, and just to show you that without having an account how you can able to perform so once you do sign into this account now you can uh, able to save that list whatever i have uh, discussed so thank you for watching this uh, video please do like share uh, this video with your you know group and uh, please hit the bell icon so that you will get the notification for my new videos please stay tuned thank you thank you for watching <music>